Well, Thomas, happy new year. Welcome back to Competitive Golf. Obviously, it's a completely different format this week, starting the year off very differently. How much are you looking forward to, to the Hero Cup this week? Absolutely amazing week. Uh, as I said many times to some of your colleagues, uh, last time I played a team event, I think, was, uh, was during my amateur times. You know, I've obviously played college golf in America and then I came back, uh, played Palmer Cup, uh, Bonalak Trophy, Jack Ligley's Trophy, all of those are extremely fantastic events actually that I've played uh, with names like John Rahm, Matthias Schwab, other great, great uh, uh, European players. Um, and I've just simply have amazing memories of it, you know, and uh, I'm looking forward to, uh, to have another fantastic week this week with, with some of the guys and most of the guys actually on the team are, are, are some of my really good friends. So it, it should, should really be a, a fantastic week. You mentioned all that amateur match play experience. Is it a format that you enjoy? Yes, yes, definitely. It's a format that we enjoy. You know, we talked about it last night with Paul McGinley and Thomas, and it's a sprint, you know. You, you need to get off to a really strong start. Uh, they came up with a stat, actually, that I wasn't aware, but if you one up after six holes, you have an 82% chance of either winning or tying the game. So, uh, so pretty much uh, getting off to a strong start is, uh, is important. You know, a stroke play event, four-day stroke play event is a marathon. This is a sprint. So, uh, so this will be the focus for the week. You know, try to get off to a strong start, control the game, and uh, and keep the keep the foot on the pedal, and uh, and bring a game to uh, bring a point to the team. You mentioned last night with those Ryder Cup legends. How important was that to hear from them, to get some experience and and some knowledge from them as well? Well, fantastic. Um, Jose Maria has an unbelievable storytelling. You know, he's got some. Fantastic stories with uh, with obviously Seve, uh, um, McGinley is a brilliant. I mean, I can't even imagine how good he must have been in the locker room when he was uh, uh, a winning captain a few years back. Uh, so definitely, uh, definitely very inspiring stuff. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm trying to uh, get as much information in as possible uh, during this couple of days that I'm spending with these guys. Now, obviously, the Ryder Cup will be on people's minds of course it's a, a huge event yes. how much is this week an opportunity for yourself to be put in the shop window ahead of, ahead of that in September well, I think we all know that we've got uh, we've got what it takes to be in that Ryder Cup team you know but now it's it's really to show uh, who's got the most heart you know who, who really believes in it and he really wants to, sh to show to show the tool and to show all the guys that we really want to we want we really want to be in that team and, and bring a point to, to, to the team as well during that Ryder Cup so uh, so the next couple of months are going to be, uh, you know, for me, not really so much just focus on the Ryder Cup. You know, I'm just going to just going to play my game, you know, focus on my on my goals. And, uh, and if I reach these goals, I think I should uh, easily make that team. So I'm really much, very much looking forward to it. And just finally, obviously, it's a very different dynamic this week. You're playing with a lot of friends on your team and you'll also have a lot of friends on the opposing team. But they'll turn into rivals at some point. How do you think you'll manage those relationships this week? Uh, no problem at all. I've got no problem at all looking them in the eye and telling them that I want to beat them badly. So uh, um, yes, I, I think most, of, most, yeah, like you say. I mean, they're both they're all good friends of mine, and um, I'm just looking forward to uh, to get off to a strong start and uh, and keep control of the game. So that's it. We wish you all the best. Thank you very much, Thomas. Welcome back to competitive golf here at the Hero Cup this week. A completely different event, a new event. How much are you looking forward to, to playing this week? Um, uh, fantastic. Uh, J'ai évidemment déjà joué beaucoup de, de tournois en équipe, uh, mais surtout en amateur. Je fais beaucoup de Palmer Cup avec John Ram, avec d'autres joueurs, avec Thomas Peters aussi. Uh, des bonnes Trophy, trophies, des Jacques Léglis trophies, mais encore jamais en tant que pro. Donc voilà, pour pouvoir, uh, pouvoir revivre ces expériences uh, d'amateur uh, là maintenant en tant que pro avec uh, la plupart uh, de mes amis d'ailleurs qui sont dans cette équipe. Uh, uh, je pense que c'est de bonne augure pour, uh, pour une très très bonne semaine. How much are you using this week to show off your and showcase your, your match play capabilities? Alors, il faut savoir que cette semaine, c'est voilà, du match play, donc c'est plus un sprint, c'est pas vraiment un marathon comme, euh, comme, un, comme quatre tours en stroke play. Donc voilà, je pense que, je pense que le focus aujourd'hui, ça va être de, cette semaine, pardon, ça va être de démarrer, de, démarrer, de, de bien démarrer les matchs, euh, d'essayer d'avoir le contrôle des matchs dès le début et, et, de, et de pouvoir montrer qu'on qu qu a le dessus et, 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 et pas se, les faire, se laisser faire par l'équipe par, par, par adverse. You'll have friends in both camps this week. Some of them will turn into rivals as the week goes on. How will you manage those relationships? 
Alors euh, oui, c'est vrai qu'on a, on a beaucoup d'amis dans les deux équipes. Écoutez, c'est du match play, c'est la vie. Euh, c'est pas, 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 pas pour autant différent qu'un tournoi en stroke play quand on joue avec un, avec un ami en, en partie le dimanche. Donc je pense que voilà, c'est chacun pour soi et chacun pour son équipe et on va tout faire pour amener un point pour, pour l'équipe européenne. Okay, thank you.